With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone. A long solenoid of radius r carries time dependent current i is equal to i naught t minus 2t square. A circular ring of radius r is placed near the center of the solenoid. Makes an, its plane makes an angle 30 degree with the solenoid. The time at which the magnetic flux through the ring is maximum. So if you make a solenoid, let's say this is a solenoid. So inside the solenoid, the magnetic field direction will be parallel to it like this. And uh, if, if I draw a ring that is present inside, its plane make an angle 30 degree with the axis. Like uh, if I draw it, its plane is said it is making an angle 30 degree. Like this. So, this angle is said it is 30. So, the area vector will be making an angle of, uh, this angle is said it is 30. So, area vector making an angle of 60. So, we wanted to, if you see at which time the flux will be maximum and we know that the flux is B dot A, right. So, I will write down it is B A cos theta, right. So, if you see the magnetic field inside a solenoid, we know that it is mu naught I into the number of turn per unit length N. So, if you see here, the I is varying with time. So, I will write down it is number of turn per unit length. I is I naught T minus 2 T square. So, you can see uh, in the flux expression, if you put the value of theta as well, it will be 60 degree. So, everything else is constant. If you put the value here, it is I naught, it is B A, it is cos 60 these all are constant right if you see mu naught and i is the flux through it right uh, is the magnetic field through the into the solenoid and uh, this is the area of this coil this 60 degree is the angle so let's differentiate this so if i say this constant at c so i will write down it is c and uh, it will be 1 minus 40 is it will be equals to 0 right so we know that to maximize anything to maximize anything uh, the differentiation of that we have to make 0 because we know that when the value reach to maximum the rate of change of that will become 0 right so if you equate it with 0 you will get the time is equal to 1 by 4 second and this is the answer I can check for the option here. So, C is the correct one. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.